MGT, what it do? It's your boy Moody Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do, man. Become a subscriber, like the video, and join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this beautiful fucked up matrix. Now, first of all, I gotta say a special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within, and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, this is what we do, bro. We work on ourselves every single day. All right, so without further ado, I'm gonna get into the video. Um, Something for the past like three weeks have kind of been on my mind. And I don't see how guys can do this shit anymore, bro. Like this, this whole, like in other words, there's nothing wrong with, you know, texting a female. There's nothing wrong with communicating with a female. There's nothing wrong with, you know, being on the phone and linking up and making plans and doing what you do with a female. But you understand on your retention journey, bro, that like, you, you see that you're putting yourself first. First of all, you see that you see that you are taking care of what you're supposed to be doing in your life. You see what's actually important. You see like, okay, this is way more important than just having one night out with uh, some friends and shit. And then now you got to think about, damn, I got to I got to make back this money because of that one night or I went on this uh, this this vacation. And now I got to like uh, I got to hustle double times to get back what I uh, spent and what I lost. Like you essentially understand what's at stake every single day when you're on your journey. You become high value. And you also realize this, bro, that everything is a cycle. Everything is a pattern. And pretty much if you not if you're not in the situation where you can put yourself in a wave of like, OK, we are elevating ourselves. That's just what any guy girl whatever you feel me if if they can't put that put themselves in that energy where they want to elevate themselves you know it's a waste of time and a lot of women believe it or not bro are here to waste your fucking time to steal your energy steal your seed probably trap you you feel me and i'm not saying all women are like this but this is what i learned i'm like i value my time and i value like what's at stake so with that being said I don't really be texting females no more, bro. You feel me? Um, especially now, it's just, it's a whole lot more crazier now because usually when I, if I text a female, it's all about, and I guess it's the same retention and communication and how everything works and what to look out for. But I'm usually, I'm actually texting a female for a reason if I'm actually doing it, okay? I'm at, it's either, this is a mutual friend or a coworker or some somewhere of the sort. You feel me? Where if we if I already have your number type shit, that's cool. Because trust and believe, I got women at places where I go to, and I I could I could see that they want to fuck. You feel me? I could see that they want to hang out. They want to chill. They want my attention type shit. You feel me? But I'm not. I'm not concerned about like what they got going on. Like again, I'm not gonna sit here and just. Say, oh, yeah, I'm going to have one night out where I'm just chilling and shit. Like, I understand, like, I have to build my life. Unlike other people, me, I still got to get my kingdom. Unlike other guys and shit who got their kingdom, got the hoes and all that other shit. That's another level. You feel me? They got to deal with different devils. You feel me? My devil is literally, sometimes it be staring me right in my motherfucking face. Sometimes I get in the way of elevating myself and bettering myself by putting myself in a position where... I'm dealing with low vibrational women. You feel me? And again, even when you're dealing with low vibrational women, they're not stupid. They can blind you by their attributes. They really can. You know what I'm saying? Going back to yesterday when I was like, um, that one chick that you know that's just doesn't have all the attributes, but some way, somehow you're attracted to them. Yeah, man. They know how to really work their magic when it comes to their energy. But, uh, yeah, like I said, what I realized on my on my retention journey though is that I know what's important and then and then I recognize cycles and patterns. The real main reason why I don't even text females no more now, or at least the females that I know, is because they all operate on the same type of pattern. It is mind blowing. They all they literally they say it's like all women are like this uh same and not the same they most of them are the same i don't have time to sit there and send a text message and and now i gotta wait or i hope or because again if a ch if a chick texts me 
especially nowadays, it's like, why? What do you want? You feel me? I don't even, I don't even like playing that little, oh, I miss you, or oh, I can't wait to see you, oh, da 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 da. That shit gets, come on, bro. Like, you know what she gonna say. Listen, when you're on your retention journey, you hold it on to your seat, you got more life force energy, you have more access to infinite intelligence. And I say this shit all the time. And it's true. You literally become smarter. You just be like, nigga, like this is a whole, this is this, this is a whole uh, simulation. And there's like s different patterns and cycles that every single person does every single year. This is why I don't even tell, I'll be texting people. My phone dry as hell right now. The most I'm doing on my phone right now, nowadays, is playing eight ball, nigga. And if you want that smoke at eight ball, you can get it too. Nah, but most of the time, like for real, for real, I I don't, I don't, I really don't waste time. I just, because this, the more I invest in myself as far as my energy goes, it's like when I choose to share it with a female, she has to, she has to handle that shit the right way. She has to come correct. Women will do this shit on purpose. They will... Um, they'll chase you sometimes, and then once they know that you got, uh, they got your, uh, you, once they know that they got, I'm fucking up right now, <laughs> once they understand that, uh, they got your attention, my bad, that's when, um, they'll play this game where it's like, now they want to play with your energy, well, I don't know, so... Like you'll she like she'll text you hey hey da 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 do you work today? I just be like yeah sure da 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 da, and then you probably won't hear from her for like another two three days. Women will do that, shit. and it's not like you. It's not like they're trying to play these mind games, but but we just have to understand like they're going to going through different emotional states throughout the day. Sometimes they could go. From here down low all the way up to the motherfucking top, and then you probably won't hear from them for another two, three days, four days. You know what I'm saying? Some women suffer through depression. There's so much things that they go through on a daily basis that we can't really that we can't really sit here and be like, damn, how to be ready for this or how to be ready for that. So understanding energy, understanding what you know. Just um, what's at stake, essentially, bro, for you. Because you, cause essentially, we're all doing this shit to stay focused and build our kingdom and get what we want to get without getting distracted by the low vibrational females or the low vibrational fruit or whatever that will drag us down. Because it will, it will have... I, I've been drugged down plenty of times, bro. And I'm thinking... And it's so funny because... I grew up innocent and I was thinking like, well, shit, if a female like me and a female sweet and nice, then that's cool. Like, OK, I'm going I'm to give her my energy. Essentially, you starting to invest your energy into to this woman. Though every woman I thought I, I, I had the best interest. I'm like, OK, she's a nice girl. She's a nice girl. She's a nice girl. Newsflash. New, uh, um, nice girls do not exist. And the nicer they are, bro, is the more you need to watch their ass. OK, and this is again, this is just understanding energy and understanding patterns. And, and while you holding on to your energy this whole time, because, again, you're not giving into sex or you're not giving into all this other shit where it's like because like right now I'm I'm going back to being in monk mode. Like I'm not even being active no more. You get what I'm saying? Not right now, at least. It just doesn't make no sense. You feel me? And I'm at that point where I'm just like. Just like what my homeboy said, listen, man, if I have, if, if, if the next three females that I happen to have sex with, one of y'all is getting pregnant. In other words, I don't really like to use the condoms and shit and all the other shit, you feel me? But again, that's a different topic for a different day. But just understand um, when you are on your journey and you stand on your journey and shit, like everything is a pattern, everything is a cycle. And you want, and then as far as the text and the females, like you just want to have time for that, bro. I don't have time to sit around and think like, damn, what is she doing? That's that's her still your energy. I don't I don't sit down and think for for nothing. You feel me? I'm not gonna completely ignore a female. Like if she hit me up or whatever, she wanna hang out. I don't even know about that because women love to uh to to flake. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So it's a 
it's just a it's just a whole lot when it comes to you just staying on your journey, staying on your purpose, and understanding once you get to another level, once you get to that new level, that's when you have more of a cushion, bro. You feel me? And then you don't ever want to rest when you do have that cushion at the same time, too. You get what I'm saying? Like, you definitely want to just stay on point no matter what you're doing every single day. Understand the benefits that come from retaining. You feel me? The glow, your voice, the confidence, the willpower. You feel me? The energy, the, uh, the more electricity that's flowing through your body, you naturally will look more attractive to females. And especially females that don't even know you, there is going to be like, damn, there's something about the, your energy or the electricity that you have or like, damn, you walk with an enthusiasm. You know what I'm saying? Um, you'll get you'll get approached and you'll have women that want to chill and hang out with you and shit. But but again, understand patterns, understand cycles, understand like when a female is like, again, you don't always have to completely ignore them, but just. Just know, because again, the devil, if the devil was to show himself or herself or whatever, the devil wouldn't come up to you and say, oh, I'm the devil. I'm going to take over your life. I'm going to fucking destroy you. Nah, the devil doesn't do that shit. Everything is, hey, how you doing? Hey, the, hey, check out this this good deal that I'm going to do for you or whatever the case may be. You feel me? So we just got to be aware. We just have to be aware. And as far as communication goes, me personally... I don't have the patience. I, I go, as far as my energy shifts, um, they call me moody for a reason. I control my emotional state, but I don't have the time to think of what is somebody doing. Like, in other words, you have you have but so, li so, so little time to text me back, bro. Because after that, I'm just going to block your ass. And then we'll try again tomorrow. You feel me? Don't do what I do, but that's what I do. I, I just don't care. I, I really understand that, like, you're going to have some orbiters. You know how, like, you have with women, they have <clears throat> beta male or orbiters that just will always text them, always give them money, always whatever. You actually, as a guy, will actually have orbiters, too, with women. But they will never, they're not, they're not giving you money. They're just basically taking your energy and entertaining you. And if you give, and if you give them the time and the energy, bro, you, if she ain't about shit, you're gonna lose yourself. In other words, so make sure if you dealing with a woman, because I'm not saying don't like a woman or don't try to court a woman or don't try to, because regardless of the fact, we want to deal with their emotional um, states up and down, up and down. Every woman has that same type of emotional roller coaster, but it's all about finding or attracting the type of woman that's actually about something. And you'll know. Because you'll be like, well, damn, i never seen this, this this type of cycle or pattern before. Damn, she really... She, damn, okay, I see you. I see how you moving and shit. Okay, cool. Maybe we can work with this. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? So, without further ado, I'm going to end the video for today. But make sure you like, share, comment down below. I'm going to definitely see you guys on the next video. Just be mindful of where you will invest your energy. Especially when you stay on your journey, stay on your purpose. Just know every single day there's somebody out there trying to get some of your energy because it's not of this world. Um, it's godlike, and literally you're bringing it from a different universe here into this realm of reality. And you have to understand that you are unique. No matter what you're doing in life, bro. Don't get distracted. Know exactly what you want. Understand the cycles and patterns that will happen. Some women will try you. I don't give a fuck how perfect you think you will be or how perfect you think you are. There's always going to be somebody that's going to try you. So just be aware. But other than that, it's me and Bowman to start. I'm going to definitely see you guys. Merch coming soon. Peace. Like, share, subscribe, comment down below, all that good stuff. I'm going to catch you guys.